Next to the presentations to outstanding motion picture writers. Of course, I'm not too familiar with them because I had lived most of my stuff. <laughs> and, really, I never... And I never... Uh, what's wrong with a teleprompter? <laughs> These awards will be made by Miss Claire Trevor in Hollywood, Mr. Carl Malden in New York and Miss Audrey Hepburn in London. Incidentally, Miss Hepburn's dressing room at Paramount is right behind mine. In fact, that's how Alfred Hitchcock got the idea for Rear Window. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, Hollywood and Miss Claire Trevor. I think you're a wonderful actor. Thank you, darling. Now for the best motion picture story. The winner is Broken Lance, Philip Jordan. In New York, Mr. Carl Malden. Thank you, Bob, and good evening. And now, for the best story and screenplay. <laughs> On the waterfront, Bud Schulberg. Well, thank you very much. And because my old man, B.P. Schulberg, was a screenwriter back in 1912 and wrote something called The Eagle's Nest for D.W. Griffith, and because a picture he made called Wings, I think, I think won the first Academy Award for the best production, this little fellow gives me an added kick tonight. And thank you very much. Thank you. And thank you, Carl Malden. This is a desperate hour. And now from London, reading the names of all the nominees as we used to do, Miss Audrey Hepburn. For best screenplay, regardless of whether developed from published material or unpublished story by some other writer or writers, the following writers have been nominated. Stanley Roberts, The Cane Mutiny, Stanley Kramer Productions, Columbia, George Seaton, The Country Girl, Pearlberg Seaton Productions, Paramount, John Michael Hayes, Rear Window, Patron Incorporated, Paramount, Billy Wilder, Samuel Taylor, and Ernest Lehman, Sabrina, Paramount, Albert Hackett, Francis Goodridge, and Dorothy Kingsley, Seven Brides for Seven Brothers, MGM. And the winner is... The Country Girl, George Seaton. We haven't got time. I'm not supposed to say thanks. I merely want to express my gratitude to everybody who helped. Thank you. Wonderful job, George.